Hey, how are you memevs doing today? Welcome everyone to your daily dose of Africa. This is a show that will give all you Caucasians and other Westerners a little taste of how crazy, wild, beautiful, and unique Africa can be. So, as we all know, you know, being a thief and stealing something that is not yours, it's against the law, pretty much all over the world. But here in America, if you get caught stealing most of the time, you'll get arrested, maybe end up in jail. Well, folks, over in crazy fucking Africa, you'll still, most of the time, end up in jail if you get caught. But it's getting arrested part that's done just a little bit differently. So, uh, yeah, not sure how long this has been a thing, but... Lately, if you steal something, these criminals have been, uh, getting arrested by bees. Yes, getting brought to justice by a swarm of bees. It is said that the victim, it will go and consult a local witch doctor to where the witch doctor will send her policing bees out to catch and handcuff the victims. Mm, maybe he swarm his face or swarm his body, cuff his hands. It's fucking pretty shitty. But, um, check it out for yourselves, guys. Here it is. So I'm guessing that's the witch doctor shaking her little maraca bag there. Not really sure. Either way, the bees went, found the guys, handcuffed them. And now the cops are going to take them to the station. It's not the only case. It's not the only other time this has happened, though. So, uh, let's watch this next one. Because it uh, only gets fucking crazier. Mm-hmm. Smoking wild and crazy Africa. Yeah, so here we go. We got a man arrested by bees after stealing a television and a mattress in Kenya. The mm. bees went and got him. Well, because the store owner went and consulted uh, the victim. All right, the witch doctor. Yeah, it's a fucking witch doctor. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. Look at You can't see. Look at his fucking face when he turns around. He's got that stupid duck face. Look at his stupid lips. Me, 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 me. Honking Africans. Swear to God. What are we going to do with these fucks? Uh, you know, you think we got it bad here? We don't have it that bad. The guy still is walking with the TV and the mattress. It seems like he doesn't give a fuck about the bees. I don't know what the fuck's going on, but... I mean... I don't know. I, I'm confused. I'm confused. I mean, did he get away with the TV and mattress and just deal with the bees? Either way, what a crazy man man. Shit. Bro, crazy fucking Africans, swear to God. Hey, this next one now, we got a, we got a reporter actually reporting on it. You, let's listen to him. These are the people, they have been stealing cattle. This is the cattle they have been stealing. The police has come to apprehend them. And this is the owner. I'm the owner. And these guys have been apprehended. They were stealing cattle and they put bees on their hands. It's the police. And uh, this is the cattle they were stealing. Can I talk to the owner, sir? Can I talk to you, sir? Can I talk to you, sir? Okay. How are you, sir? Fine. How are you? Uh, you're not fine because they have been stealing your yes, cows. Yes, I'm not fine. Yes. Mm. So, uh, what did you do? How can they have bees on their hands? The, the bees. Mm. I have got the, the witch doctor. Yes, sir. When I'm out there watching at uh, TikTok, uh, yeah. I get the number for the witch doctor. Okay, okay. For the witch doctor. Yeah. He's the one which can be assist me. Yep, so that's another one. Guy went to the witch doctor, and the witch doctor sent out her, her, uh, her arresting bees, and they caught the suspects, bring them to jail. So the next one here, this one, same thing. Guy stole the car. The bees actually went into the car and uh and the guy uh yeah went into the car and arrested the guy so that's fucking crazy according to bungoma residents who claim to have witnessed the spectacle a visibly pained francis sikadigu turned up at the town's police station 
minus his shirt <laughs> and holding car keys. <laughs> Some even claim to have witnessed a colony of bees escorting the Ugandan while doing what angry bees normally do, sting. The story, however, gets an even stranger buzz. Francis, it is alleged, turned himself in after the bees struck him inside a car he had stolen after dragging its owner. Yeah, so since these bees have been around, uh, we don't even need a lot of cops anymore. The bees are just taking over the whole police force, so yeah, fuck it. Don't really know what to say, but I uh, want to give a shout out to all my memes, my memes back home, all my memes behind me who got the sickest squad in Africa. What's up, memes? Pierre, fuck you. Peace. But it turned out the bees were acting under instructions, at least according to the car owner who confessed to consulting a famous witch doctor. Man, I don't know though, see, I don't know if I believe in the witch doctor, because, you know, if the witch doctor, if this was real, you know, I'd, be, I'd have bees swarming all over my body, because I steal every girl's heart in Africa. Who? They don't call me Mr. Bomb Bomb Lover for nothing. Hmm. I'm the head may may in charge around here, bitches. Woo. Hmm. So are uh, the buzz around the African villages. Uh, you'd be fucking crazy to get caught stealing. Because, uh, yeah, it looks kind of painful. But, uh, maybe we should you know, do that over here. Huh? Fucking, I'm arrested by bees. I'm a fucking send my fucking poodle out there to arrest motherfuckers. So, yeah, hi. So, uh, it's the first daily dose of Africa. Shout out to all my memes out there. And, uh, we'll be getting another daily dose maybe tomorrow. I don't know, though, because I got other shit to do. And, uh, so, yeah, this is Geo2 signing out. Peace.